Okay, it has been one full year of start playing and I am super excited. This has been one of the best years of my life because I think I've grown a lot, I've learned a lot, and I've expanded into areas that I never would have thought even could be possible last year. More importantly, I've gotten a little bit outside of myself and I've learned to say yes when it feels like it'd be easiest, it would be safest to say no. So I just wanted to take this week to show some of the highlights for me uh, some of the favorite things that I did in the last year. It started out with me just coming down here into this room and playing the drums, playing the guitar and the bass, and just seeing what would happen. I'm just gonna start playing, see what happens. From there, I got so excited about the idea of just going for it, getting rid of all those things that held me back, and so I just kept making more videos. Hello. One take. We're gonna do some Taylor Swift covers today. Until one day we took it outside and decided to go a little bit further than we had gone before. And that video got me pretty excited about some of the other things that we could do. So then I lit my drumsticks on fire and I played in my garage. And around that time my friend Jake gave me a call and he said, before you say anything, I want you to say yes to this idea. We played in an abandoned warehouse in Philadelphia, so I flew out there with my wife, with all our gear, um, and it was just a crazy experience. That is the most fun I've ever had as a musician. I remember the moment when we're playing, it's about to hit the crescendo of the song, and I just realized, like, I have never had more fun than this. And I want to keep having experiences like this. We got so excited that we wanted to do it again. And this time we stepped it up even further. Uh, we started in the morning. We shot in front of an aircraft carrier. And then we shot in front of the ocean on the beach. And then in the evening, we shot in the middle of Times Square. And I can't tell you the feeling of shooting in that place. Of course, not every week can be like that. I'm not a very good... It's a theme here. I don't know if you're catching this yet. If this doesn't work, I'm just gonna delete this video. We showed, you know, how to write a song from start to finish in one day. Save you know, a delay pedal on the drums. Uh, we did a nice Valentine's Day video. Just some, some good music. Some bad music. We shot a music video on a boat. Dueling drum sets. We strapped a drum set on top of a trailer. I learned how to clone myself. Are you serious? One take, no rehearsing. Let me see what happens. I had some young people come who are super talented. Some not quite as young people who are also super talented. I wouldn't be here without all of the help that I've gotten. Um, Holly, you have been so encouraging to me. My brother has helped me a ton with filming. Uh, my friend Jake has encouraged me. My friend Adam has given me ideas, encouraged me. Um, I've just had a lot of people help me along the way. Um, and all of you who've watched these videos, um, it's just been encouraging doing this. For me, the most exciting part though is when we create a video, we create something, and it inspires you guys to do something.
So hey, if you like these videos, hit the subscribe button. All these people depend on you for their welfare. We might not make it out alive. <laughs> Seriously, thank you for watching. See you next week.